so I'm making an update video to my last 2x2 two two spruce tree farm. This one is a corner attraction, so you plant this top first. Uh, this, the first one is 16 that I know of that has a llama. And yeah, I'll kind of explain how it works. So, I already released this, made a video about this. But this is the alignment we use. So you have to get this, then you need four snow layers, and then a boat, and a llama, then once you have the boat and the llama, you have to put the llama on the boat, that's kind of annoying, but you have to get them on, then once you have once you have that, if you come down here, you close the fence gate, hit F3B, make sure this blue line is lined up against that uh, corner. Then you want to back up, make sure just for right now, the no blocks are over here. Then you want to get some soul sand, and you want to zero take this in from this block to so the piston and gravity thing and soul sand actually has a bunch of inner hitboxes and those inner hitboxes are equal to snow layers so you can see here that it's actually identical to snow layers and we use that there to uh, have a full block where we normally have snow layers so then for the alignment we want to back it up until The llama's border of its hitbox, that white line right there, should be a bit farther back. It should line up to about right there on the soul sand. Then you want to activate that to uh, get it back aligned against this wall. Then you need to zero tick a piston in here. And for that, you can do this. That's nice and simple. Then after that, you see right here, you need to actually get a cart right there. So what we need to do is get some glass and <clears throat> we need to drop the cart down like this. Then over here, we get glass and just the piston. Let me zero take it in. And droppers just back where they were before. A bit di uh, tiny bit different in the actual farm because this isn't the actual farm. It's pretty similar though. Then you have that. This block here can be. Actually, this block needs to be. Well, this will be a dropper in the actual farm, but it just needs to be glass. So. Need to zero take it in from here. And then one more, it will suffocate, but then just break it after if you have a break. And then that's all those blocks, and the llama should be aligned. Then we need to get these two pistons in, so just place those like that, and then those two pistons like that, and then just zero take these in. You can actually just push these in. And then that's pretty much all the alignment, but now there's a couple more things we have to do. We need to put this puzzle in. And then we need to we need to put this puzzle in. And for this we're gonna actually need two pistons. And then that should be the alignment done, but there's a couple more things we need to do. So actually right here, we need a fence and another fence where we break these two. And then we need a fence gate like that and a fence gate like that. Then we need a boat. Now the boat needs to be aligned against the fence gate. 
the ship falls down and then just right up against it. Then we need to actually put that log there, and then we need to zero tick this piston. Then you can place that. And then we need to get another boat and put that boat right here. And then you need to get on the llama so the boat falls. Okay. Now, the point of this boat is actually because there's an issue. If we don't have this boat, um, I think it would feel better set up for this. We can use actual plane. If we don't have this boat, and we have something like this, as if the farmer's actually running. is actually running. Break the boat. If you don't have a boat, you see the llama, or you, the player on the llama will actually get pushed forward up against this log, and you'll miss uh, saplings, and it'll actually mess with the placement of saplings. So, with that boat, uh, I'll put it on this one. With this boat, what will happen is have player line correctly, then you actually won't win. And because of that, you can do all your plays normally and things will work properly. I can show you the actual form running. It also has the option to be clocked and not clocked by any event, right here. Uh, we'll do clocked. Then just grab your screw stuff and Just to look at the right angle, right here, so you don't actually get that clock. farm than my old one. This only has hopper carts in the DPE. Uh, my old farm, there was a shit ton of hopper carts. So I hope that helps, and this farm's a lot better. Uh, it's like 8 MS. On 9900K, it was like 8 MS. Uh, a couple extra things I forgot to mention was this is faster than my old farm. It's like 347,000 uh, opposed to the old one, it was like 336. So, the log transport is also better. Uh, yeah, it's, it's a lot better. 